everyone, Lewis here, and I thought I'd bring you some recent news relating to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. This week, Niantic has announced that there will be an event in honor of new Pokemon Snap, which comes out April 30th, the day before its release. On April 29th at 10 a.m. until May 2nd, 8 p.m. local time, Pokemon that appear in the game from generations 1 through 6 in the Lintal region, which is a tropical island, will be appearing in the wild in raids, and of course, Shiny Smeargle will finally be making its debut in Pokemon Go. Which, of course, after this event ends, Smeargle cannot be Shiny until another event that relates to Smeargle will appear in future encounters for future events. In other Pokemon news, also announced... We are getting an Earth Day event in the game called Stub Sanity Week, or yeah, yes, Niantic Substanity Week, which of course fellow trainers can earn in-game bonuses for doing things like picking up trash in the real world, and of course this event will also mark the debut of Binnacle, a water and rock type Pokemon from Gen 6, and you'll also get a free t-shirt for your avatar. This event starts this Tuesday, April 20th at 10 a.m. and ends Sunday, April 25th at 8 p.m. local time. And of course, Pokemon such as Grimer, Drillbur, Trubbish, Burrow Seed and many more will be appearing in the wild often. And of course, Shiny Trubbish will be making its debut in the game. The following Pokemon that will be available from 5k eggs will be Diglett, Tangela, Goldeen, Buddu, Cherubi, Finneon, and Drillbur. And of course, Vileplume, Alolan Executor, Trubbish, Binnacle, and more will also be appearing in raids and of course complete event exclusive field research to earn encounters with cotton tea chest pin binnacle and more there will also be an event exclusive timed research for you to enjoy as well and of course also announced is Friendship Day, which will be next Saturday, April 24th, from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. local time. And of course, various grass types will be appearing in the wild. There will be a collection challenge, and of course, take part in the Friendship Global Challenge. For each hourly challenge you complete, you'll earn a lot of XP. Green Confetti will also be appearing on the map in celebration of this event. One more thing. This Saturday, Harry Potter Wizards Unite Community Day for the month of April will be in that game. And of course, I'll be doing a video about that. And I'll also be doing a video about Friendship Day in the game as well. And of course... Also, I was able to make it to level 43, and I'm in the process of completing the level 43 special research in the game. Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure.
Also, during these dark times, when heading out, always wear a mask, practice social distancing, wash your hands, carry hand sanitizer with you, stay away from large crowds, get vaccinated when you're eligible to do so, and most importantly, stay safe, stay healthy, and together we will get through these dark times together. And one last thing, people who've been watching my videos have not been subscribed. If you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. And that way you can support my channel in helping me draw more viewers so you can enjoy my content in the future.